it's very essential for us to know the algebraic and order properties of R, R which is the set of real numbers. Now we observe that R is complete ordered field. What do I mean by that? Number one, it's a field. The word field expresses the algebraic properties of R. It's actually a commutative field. We'll get to know. Now field is field is a place where we have binary operations working on our numbers okay now order there is an order of less than or equal to that works in r or the set of real numbers and that's what ordered expresses completeness is expressed by uh, the word completeness expresses the topological properties the topological properties as in what I mean to say is the existence of supremum. Now, every upper bounded set is supposed to have a least upper bound. That's a pr topological property and that's one property of R which we will be looking at later. So, starting off with the field axioms or why do we call R a field? So, field axioms, these are the nine major field axioms. A field is a set of objects, anything, A, B, C, X, Y, Z, called real numbers, together with two binary operations, as I said. One is addition, second is multiplication, which satisfy the following properties. Now, what are these following properties? So, we call R to be, okay, I will be writing that later. So, R, we asserted that R is a commutative field, okay. Now, why did I say so? Number 1, so A1, because additive property, so A1, so there is commutativity, commutativity holds in R, okay. You add 1 plus 2 or 2 plus 1, you get 3, okay. Also, associativity, associativity also holds even associativity holds okay there exists zero there exists a zero such that belonging to r such that x plus zero equals to x itself okay or x plus zero equals to zero plus x equals to x okay which is a neutral element so this is one of the neutral element or additive identity if i may call it so a3 is essentially your additive identity okay now for all x belonging to r there exists some w belonging to r such that x plus w w w plus x equals to 0. Now, what is w? w essentially is the additive inverse. So, if additive identity exists, additive inverse is also there. Okay. So, essentially w is equal to minus x. That's what we mean. So, there is a minus x. Okay. So, x plus minus x will give you 0 all the time. So, these were the four major additive properties. Now, talking about multiplicative properties. Number one, there is again comm commutativity as you can see here. So, commutativity holds. What else holds? I can probably change the color. Commutativity holds. Associativity also holds for all x, y, z. x into y into z will be equal to x into z into y okay then what holds okay. next there is a multiplicated identity or a neutral element so identity element identity element one one is the identity element which is not equal to zero Okay, there is some element like 1 which is not equal to 0 such that 
x into 1 x multiplied by 1 equals to 1 multiplied by x equals to x itself ok now also what will hold once you have uh, you have identity element now also for any for any x ok for any real number or for all real number x which does not equal to 0 x which does not equal to 0 there will there exist w belonging to the r real number such that such that x into w equals to 1 so what is this w this w is essentially 1 by x okay so when identity element exists there is an inverse element also so there is there exists an inverse element of every real number so if x is a real number then 1 by x is also a real number okay now next very important property so next very important property is the distributivity is the distributivity of multiplication with addition multiplication with respect to addition as you can see here ok so there is distributivity of multiplication with respect to addition so these are the fa field axioms and they all are satisfied by R ok R or the set of real numbers satisfies all these algebraic properties and we call R just write down the notification R okay which is a field under plus and dot we say it is a commutative commutative field okay commutative because it's commutative with respect to both the functions or binary operations plus as well as dot.